hello and welcome back hope you are good doing well so we are having a wti update so wti we were expecting wti to hold the top and drop but we can see that the wti broke out the top and uh, and uh, pushing slightly more higher so we were expecting wti to hold that previous top and uh, break out of that trend and continue to keep dragging lower for one, one more lag uh, back to that bottom so if I'm gonna look at this chart, all right. So this is the WTI with the upper. I'm gonna pull out this chart and look at the oil and uh, upper. So we have seen copper deeper retracement after that, you know, sell off from that top. Okay, so we have seen a similar trending move on copper and similar trending move on uh, on uh, oil as well from these lows. Okay, remember when we were expecting oil to bounce back from these lows. Okay, so we have that move and oil went up to to 130, all right, and then started to drop. So drop from that top. So we have seen uh, uh, that move at the same time right so let me pull out this yeah so when we have seen crash so we have seen a trending move on both charts since then so this strong bullish move strong bullish moves so, and, and and from top we have seen you know sell off and uh, sell off from uh, that chart to let me try to check a uh, two week chart i think we have got from here and uh, we are within that you know uh, draw from that top so basically to 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 compare these two, two charts the, the point to compare these two charts is that the 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 the, the copper the traced of that previous bullish bearish wave back to 618 and uh, there is there is a there is a chance that uh, oil can do that too okay, there is a possibility not we we are not having confirmation but there is a there is a chance and uh, there is a there is a uh, you know uh, a perfect logic behind that that the oil you know can uh, retrace up to that 618 or 100 dollar right wta can retrace up to 100 dollar mark and then we may see continuation to the downside very much similar like the the copper is doing right now and there is also a chance that we may not see that one more up move and uh, and uh, oil oil you know gonna start you know falling to the downside all right so the actually you know uh, some commodities are are you know struggling so like like if we're going to look at the wheat okay we haven't seen a retracement that much on wheat we have seen that uh, retracement but retracement was not that degree all right and we have seen a trending move to the downside on wheat so so that's the point all right so uh, the reason why there is a risk for the oil to go that much high up to 100 there are a couple of things which can drive oil back to that 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 high. The one is that uh, the the Fed pause, all right, you know, uh, uh, reversal in the policy or or, or pause in the in the Fed hiking cycle, and the second thing is that uh, I mean uh, weaknesses in dollar in longer term because of the 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 Fed pause, and the other thing is that uh, the the SPR, the the oil reserves, you know. Uh, uh, have uh, depleted in the US USA now they are you know uh, building up their reserves they are buying oil you know uh, building up their reserves that's also causing um, and, uh, you know oil to push up and um, the other factor is that the OPEC also trying to push the prices higher so these are the factors which can support the oil prices to push up to $100 so there, there there is a you know perfect logic that the oil can push up 200 but we are not looking oil to go to 100 what we are looking actually we are looking inflation to fall and uh, 
significant slowdown in the economy which is already affecting the the demand of the oil and and demand is is dropping significantly and uh, supply is, has uh, increased significantly which has caused that oil to stay trending to the downside so so that's that's i think is more important factor which can play out for oil to to drag lower rather than you know going higher so that's a bigger picture so if i'm going to look at the lower time frame we are expecting oil to to fall for another lag lower so if i'm going to remove everything from my oil chart so we were expecting oil to draw from there from that top the the the, 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 the breakout we were expecting breakout from there right off this previous trending move so we got we got the seller from there all right we got the seller from there we have a decent night Im nice impulsive move from there and prices just simply we can say that is you know correcting back to that and we are expecting this corrective move to break down for another lag lower all the way back to this low or or, or more downside so how you can you know look for a opportunity over there okay that's the previous top there there uh, there is possibility that possibility now that the oil can uh, you know visit that top before we're expecting oil to stay below and draw but it has clearly broke out and and the trend is still strong so we still can see that the oil can uh, you know correct for another time and can push more higher so that's the previous high okay 85 area the max 85 this current trend to 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 push and we only going to focus right now on this trend okay this so you are looking basically that trend to break down all right so price still running within that trend so what you are looking actually you are looking price to correct or break down all right correct or break down all right and keep falling or push up for another leg higher all right and then again after hitting that top fall back all right that's 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 what you are looking right now so you're basically looking for price to either correct for another time all right correct for another time very much similar like that we were expecting this to correct and then drop so we got a sell off but we haven't got a correction over there so i have already explained that in the previous video analysis that what you are looking at that time you were paying attention at that and, and looking for for another drop so we haven't got that breakout so correct for another time and continue to keep pushing more higher all right or simply give us a very aggressive sell off all right very much similar like that sell off and correct and 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 this correction will confirm that we are visiting that low okay so we are not expecting that move we are we are more keen to have that uh, drag to the down, to the downside okay so hopefully you got the point that what kind of price section you are looking so if we're going to see another correction another leg higher okay if we're going to see a clear breakdown sell off sharp sell off breakdown correction then you are looking another lag lower so you are paying attention over there at this area okay so the other reason which has caused that breakout this previous high is the is the green deal okay between the 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 west and uh, between the united nation and the the russia that 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 you know green deal you know uh, russia has withdrawn from that green deal which actually has caused this whole move to happen all right so so you are looking as explained that you are looking at aggressive sell-off break break down the trend okay and uh, the trend so let me show you the trend so the trend is this is just happening over there in the moving average okay we are still holding that one hour trend we have seen that trend break out here yeah, we have seen that trend out break out here but we haven't seen correction for drop so again you are looking for that trend to break and continue to keep falling hope that makes sense all right so if i'll see that the sharp sell-off is coming on the oil and it's breaking down i'll try my best to update that's what you are watching so pull back or or, or sharp sell-off on the oil all right 